As Congress debates changes in immigration policy, there's a new focus on a small town at the heart of the migrant crisis. Julia Ainsley is there for us. Tonight, this is the new epicenter of the border crisis, tiny Lukeville, Arizona, where the number of migrants is pushing Border Patrol past capacity. More than 9,000 illegal crossings along the southern border just yesterday, nearly 3,000 of them in this area. Behind me, there's a group of about 40 migrants, including young children, that were just brought in by Border Patrol after they called 911 because they were stranded in the desert. Border agents so backed up, they're taking migrants to Tucson, where they're processed and most are released into the U.S. The Lukeville International Crossing now closed for 11 days due to overwhelming demand on border agents from migrants. Business owners say they're paying a price. Last week we had made 5,000, which is what we usually would make within an eight-hour shift. We find places along the border wall where smugglers cut holes for migrants, yesterday cutting through 16 times. They mark the dates here where they fix the breaches, and you can see this one was just fixed recently. U.S. and Mexican officials tell NBC News one reason for the rise, Mexico's Border Patrol equivalent is running low on funds and stopping fewer migrants. But Republicans blame President Biden's border policies for encouraging migrants to come and are demanding changes before they'll pass more funding for Ukraine. This tonight from the Border Patrol Union. What we need to see from this administration is that they're serious about border security, because when you're allowing so many individuals to come across the border, that preoccupies a lot of agents. President Biden calls GOP proposals extreme. Migrants tell us they're desperate. We are tired. I had to carry my daughter so we could keep going, said Jacqueline from Ecuador. And this man said, we knew this was going to be hard. We do it for our families. Now Arizona's governor is asking President Biden to reassign National Guard so they can open that border crossing to traffic. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.